you know, we've went through a lot of those, those, it's like, like opening doors, you know, um, we had the music that, that really uh, opened the doors to a lot of things. You yeah. Know? Uh, gave opportunities, I think, for um, future musicians too. Mm -hmm. But we were very fortunate, and I was very grateful for um, that experience. You know, um, I think the key really is to surround yourself with the right people. You know, we jumped in head first, hook, line, and sinker, and didn't realize that the people we were with were had their own motives. You know. Mm -hmm. Um, and we were just uh, more or less setting the tra the trailblazers. Yeah, almost the the na naivety almost helped you in a way because you're it's like the Saint Ignorance's bliss where you're just like going into any opportunity, not even thinking about what could go wrong or whatever, and just, just yeah, that's going true. For it. That's you know that's yeah. passion for yeah. what you do, you know. And we loved what we doing and we the opportunities that we had playing music and you know, that that was in our blood and, mm -hmm. and but we didn't know them we didn't know the business yeah and i remember when um, we were into columbia records we had an audition at the uh, troubadour and you know i think um uh, who was there uh rick rick springfield was there bruce spring springsteen was there all these guys were trying to get um record labels yeah so we went, we had 15 minutes, did our 15 minutes, and then we got all these offers. The, the one we went with was Columbia Records, who was the biggest in the world at the time. So I remember the, I think it was the president or the A&R person says um, that uh, music is only 20% of, of the business. Mm. The business is 80%. Yeah. And that was hard to chew, but... You know, when you uh, start to learn about the business, you realize that there's a lot of truth to that. You know, if you don't know the business, I mean, it, it's just an art. Mm -hmm. So, um, so I learned a lot. Um, my experience uh, with uh, people and and um, trust in people. Um, I realized that. Uh, at one point, I realized that I had to um, learn more about the business. I had a, f a family now, and um, I have to feed them. I have to clothe them, put them to school. Um, so I realized I got to stop all this nonsense and and um, learn about the uh, business. <laughs> so that was the point when I decided that, you know, it's time for me and C to kind of like... Uh, split up and for me to learn more about the business because a lot of people were just taking advantage of us mm -hmm. and um i knew we had something special so i need to know how to make that work for us you know all these um we're still making like peanuts compared to what everybody else was making from us you know mm -hmm. So you learn your lesson, you know. Um, you know, I have no no regrets because I learned from that. I would have a lot of regrets if I didn't, uh, uh, if I stuck to to not believing in myself. You know? And um, so so from that point on, I started to learn the business mm -hmm. and realize how uh, <laughs> how. Um, uh just just not just more corrupt and and um just dishonest and and I didn't want to be a part of that part mm -hmm. of that 